Hello everybody, and welcome back to Let's Play Alan Wake, where well, last time we left off. Trouble in the maze, and in also trouble trying to beat the fat man, Hartman's personal bodyguard person. Well, we're back now, and we're alive, and we're trying to press on and find our way through this garden. Which we're struggling to do at this moment in time. Ah, another light source, some plants, a coffee thermos of coffee, some flares, a hood, a shotgun, and oh, it's quite the little uh, private party we're having here, collecting all these things. So what comes up here? I think there might be a manuscript page. And I was right. Hartman sedates Wake. Hartman watched as Wake's features slackened. The man was bullheaded, no doubt. Even lying on the bed, he'd almost broken Hartman's nose the second time. But with a little time, he could break Wake down, give him proper direction. Wake was easily the most promising subject he'd had. Well, since Tom, really. Sleep well, Alan, Hartman whispered with a smile. Let me take care of you. He sniffed hard to clear his throbbing nose, swallowed blood, and barely tasted it. Oh dear. Alan bust his nose again? How did that happen? Maybe he thrashed out and is having a nightmare, you know. Like, ah, poof. Broke his nose again. Oh, Barry, you there! Come on, we gotta get the hell out of here. Ow! You're alive! Let's get out of here. Can you open this gate? Maybe. Barry. Uh, well, I slammed it shut when the nasty showed up, and the key fits kind of loose in the lock, so, uh... Barry! Oh, Barry! Barry! Would you care to hurry up, please? I'm being attacked here! Hurry up, Barry! No, 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 no. Okay. Two big daddies here. Oh, this is flaming great. Oh yeah, marvelous. Got stuck on the step. Bury a clown. Bloody can't open the gate. Just kick it down, you stupid ass. I need to get out of the step. The step is uh, too claustrophobic, too cramped in here. Right. Where is he? Come on! Dodge you that time, freak! Come closer. Prepare to eat my shotgun, you big piece of crap. No! I dodged it! Yes. No! This, where did he creep up from as well? Oh yeah, combination manoeuvre there. Oh, dodged it there. Oh, the gates are open! Flaming hell, the gates are open! Don't kill me! Oh, the gates are open! Run! I could wish I had a flare right now! Get in the car! <laughs> Whee! Run them down, Barry! Ow! 
please tell me we're headed for the nearest. You're now leaving Bright Falls. Come back soon, sign. <laughs> we're going to the Anderson farm. I knew you were going to say something like that. It was fun. You know what? You owe me big time for this. When this is through, if we make it, I don't care what anybody says, I'm done with darkness. You're going to buy me a tanning bed as a gift, and I'm going to live in it. Huh. Let's stay at that. No one else how freaky it was that he's got a bloody cardboard cut out of himself in the back of the car. What is this? Going wherever he's going? Slow I'm down, crazy, Barry. But that's fine, Barry. Oh, you got that right, Al. You're barking mad. You are by far the craziest... But maybe that's inevitable when you deal with crazy stuff like this. It helps. This is happening, Barry. Alice, they never had Alice. She's trapped in the darkness at the bottom Barry, of the lake. slow down. We could have a terrible accident I know, here. I know, Barry. I can... Al, I know. <laughs> Listen, I can bring her back. I can find her. There's something special about this place. The lake, it, it does something to the works of art created here. It makes them come true. But there's a catch. The dark presence, whatever that thing is, twists it to its own ends. That's why all of this is happening. It's using my manuscript to take over everything. Al, I believe you. It happened to Thomas Jane before, it happened to the Andersons. I believe Harry. you. Harry. Crazy or not, you're not delusional. Keep your eye on the road. Down. That's a fact. I'm on board, man. I'm with you. The Andersons knew about it, but they were too far gone to tell me with all the drugs they were on. But they wrote it down. There's a message somewhere at their farm, Barry. Oh, and no, no, look out, look out, look out! Look out! Oh! And off they go! <laughs> Into a tree! Oh, oh, no! Hello? I'm talking! <laughs> oh, dad. I had lost my gun in the crash. Barry was nowhere to be seen. Barry? Was nowhere to be seen. I heard him a minute Barry! ago. Barry! Oh, man! You're okay! Where are you? Jesus, could you hear your voice? I was trying to get out of the car, but the ground gave way! <laughs> Forget that! Are you okay? You didn't get a scratch! There's no way you can climb down though! It's like a sheer wall! What is he shouting from? Okay, let's try and make my way down, Barry. Hang on there, boy! There's something moving down here! Barry, it's a taken! Use a flare, Barry! Whoa! Yeah! Barry, are you alright? <laughs> I'm good, Al! I'm great! Guess you never messed with anyone from New York City before, huh? How many have you got of those things? Because <laughs> if you've got one, uh, next time you won't be so uh, confident, I'm telling you. Oh. Is this the farm? Barry, just wait for me, okay? Ow! I'm gonna stay here! It's suicide! I'm gonna go ahead and secure the area. You can catch up. Don't worry about it. I'm on the case. Now he's a Rambo. <laughs> this would turn into a disaster if I didn't catch up with Barry. Okay, let's get the hell out of here. Come on, Alan. Let's put some speed into this movement. Shaky, shaky, shaky! Oh, he's uprooting trees again. It's his favorite pastime now, this dark presence. Ooh, uprooting barrels. Whoa, 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 whoa! Oh. Dodge! Oh, quick, quick, quick! Get me in the light, get me in the light. Whoa, whoa, whoa! What the hell? Shut up! What is this? Oh, I'll come all this way for a manuscript page. Whoa. Blow me down. 
Let's quickly read it, and then we'll end the part. When he stopped the car at the Anderson farm, Walter felt relieved. Oblivion was close at hand. The brothers wouldn't miss a jar of moonshine or two in the booby hatch. But then he saw the man on the porch, and he knew who it was. Driving for his life and knowing it was useless, he didn't realize he was crying until he couldn't see the road for the tears. Walter? Who's Walter? Who is Walter? I can't remember Walter. Right, join me next time, and we shall continue towards the farm. And maybe find out who the hell Walter is. I'll see you then.